Right now we are tracking the tropics and a system that could develop here over these next couple of days. Bring in Chief Meteorologist Bobby Deskins. It's pretty busy out there right now. So for uh, we've been watching this first one, of course. Fiona is well east of Florida. We are going to get surf from it up and down the east coast. We're already getting that. But, man, this is a big storm, guys. 130 mile per hour winds right now. It makes it a Category 4. And it's headed just west of, uh, it looks like Bermuda. So you can see St. George right there. That's Bermuda, obviously. Uh, big eye on this thing. Big, strong storm. The modeling is in pretty good agreement. It takes it all the way up to Canada. The main threat for Bermuda. Bermuda won't see the highest winds there, but they will see some wind and rain, and that would be as we get into Thursday night, late tonight into tomorrow afternoon and the evening hours as it goes by. Now, a lot going on, but what we want to focus on right here, obviously, is Invest 98L. That's the one that the models are drifting off towards the west-northwest and then trying to, looks like, recurve it into the Gulf of Mexico. It's, there's just not a whole lot to show you right now. I want to show you the visible satellite because you can start to see a little bit more of a spin here. Watch right in here. You see that? And then it kind of moves in this direction here. So we do have, it looks like a lower level circulation starting to form. We need that. We need to know where the center is. Once we know that better, we can put that into the models and the models will give us a better solution. Right now, the models have shifted a little bit back towards the right a little bit from what we had yesterday. They've been generally in this area, but this is a pretty good spread. The further it goes this way, obviously the better it is for us. But right now we've got the European model saying it could come in down towards Marco right out here. The GFS model was way out here earlier, but now it's coming up, up towards maybe Panama City. We don't know right now, and weather guys don't, we don't like to say that, right? But we, I can uh, be honest with you, obviously we don't know. We have confidence getting in here and developing over the next couple of days. My thought is, is that by tomorrow afternoon or evening hours, we will get a depression. When we get a tropical depression somewhere down in here, we're going to get a cone. And it's likely going to be probably us on the right side and then over towards the Yucatan Channel there. So that's what I'm thinking right now. I'm going to show you coming up in just a few minutes a comparison between the GFS and the European model to give you an idea of the spread by the time we get to next week when this could be affecting us.